Tonight, friends and family are saying goodbye to a recent high school graduate who was shot and killed in his bedroom this week. 18-year-old Geraldo Oliveras was sitting in a chair playing video games at his home in Dayton early Wednesday morning. That's when someone fired multiple rounds into the house, one of the bullets hitting Oliveras in the back. Matt Doherty in Dayton tonight with this story. Matt. Hundreds of family members and friends showed up here to Dayton High School tonight, all of them still in disbelief about what happened. It's only been one month since Jerry Olivares was here on the campus of Dayton High School. The 18 year old had just graduated and was looking forward to the next chapter of his life. But those dreams for the future were lost this week, ended by a single bullet in a way that nobody could have predicted. I mean, he was just the sweetest kid. Sadly, I've been teaching long enough that I've lost a few kids. This was just a really good one. Trey Ellis was Jerry's construction teacher. He and everyone else is still trying to reconcile what happened. As Jerry was playing video games in his bedroom early Wednesday morning, a shooter was pulling up outside of his family's home. Moments later, the house was sprayed with bullets and the shooter took off. Jerry's mother and two sisters were also in the home at the time. They were not hurt. I know you miss me. But now in heaven, I will be. Tonight, Jerry's family and classmates consoled one another in their grief, praying for the young man they lost and praying for justice. What I pray is that those people are uh, brought to justice by their own conscience. Investigators say they believe the shooting was targeted, but they don't know who the target was. If you have any information, you're asked to call the Liberty County Sheriff's Office right away. Back to you.